know he'll defend the city. With the spire. South. One more time. I'm tired. I've worked enough to last a lifetime. Sun shines on those who mind their own, so they say. Aloy, what brings you to Meridian? A threat. Helis commands a legion of fanatics called the Eclipse. They will attack soon from the west with an army of ancient war machines. But that's not the worst of it. They'll bring a mind with them. God, demon, machine, whatever you want to call it. It's called Hades. And it doesn't want Meridian at all. It wants the Spire. And if it gets there, it will send out a call, waking more ancient machines, more than we could ever defeat. All will be lost. We can't let that happen. I'm trying to understand, but... My responsibility lies with Meridian. Meridian isn't the target of Odd. You have to defend the Spire. Perhaps the Vanguard, your Radiance. Yes. Send them to the Spire. Aaron knows Aloy. He won't question it. And have the City Guard fortify the Western Ridge. There they can be seen to protect Meridian and the Alight, where the Spire rests. Aloy. Allow me to... Apologize for my behavior before. If we're to fight together on the brink of life and death, I'd prefer. Then you have it. 
As long as you don't confuse me with her again. Even a king can learn his lesson. Now, it will take time to prepare our defenses. Please. I don't know about everything, but I'll... Quietly does it. Panic in the city will only create another enemy. And do keep me appraised of each new arrival. It's our Sun King safe. Ah, Aloy. Preparations are underway on the rigid defenses, and at the word was sent to every corner of the Sundom. Our allies offered their steel. Some came for Meridian, others for Shard, but many came for you by name. Don't be so humble. And the Spire. Erend and the Vanguard are there? Indeed. Uh, clashing breastplates together and testing out their battle cries, I suppose. A number of the Nora have also arrived at the Spire. They have resisted the offer of a royal audience. Perhaps you could parley with them. I will. The Ridge will be the front line. That's where the City Guard are holding? Yes. Bolstered by some of the, uh, the Osaran cannons that thundered Meridian's walls in the Liberation. You're welcome to tour the defenses. I suppose all we can do is wait for the attack. Exactly. It's not a feeling I cherish, but our spotters at Evening Sign report there's still no movement in the West. So, if there's more you need to do elsewhere, seize this time to do it. Otherwise, I've made the apartment of Olin Delverson available to you. You can sleep there, if sleep comes. So you must be Aloy, then. I thought there'd be more of you. More of me. Thicker, I suppose. More of a gear wheel, less of a ringlet. Do all Osirim flirt at the most inopportune times? Inopportune? Battle hasn't even started, you Petra Forge woman. I hail from the Free Heap. I'll be heading back in the next dust. Murad asked me to check over the city arsenal first. Cannons have aged well, but I've cleared their throats so they can really roar. Can I try one? Everybody wants it. It hits nice and wide. No need to aim it like a bow. Told you I'd be here. You did, Teb. But have your wounds. Honestly, if I fought, I'd probably come undone. But don't worry. I'll. I brought supplies instead. 
These Karja have made me an honorary quartermaster. Whatever that. <laughs> it sounds impressive. I could get used to it. We'll be setting up caches of our Aloy? When you went into the mountain, did the goddess tell you our chances? She didn't need to. I know we can do this, Teb. Maybe we can. I bet those traitorous Oseron will just conveniently lose Derval and transport to Moonstrike. Don't look to me for help. My duty is to... I don't get involved in politics. Never be able to repay you for the life of our Sun King. At least you don't put on it. I didn't expect you to come all this way. It's true, I am a stranger in this green and snowless land. Aurea forgave the Karja, but still, I was compelled to come for my once chieftain. It's good to see you leading again, and I'm proud to take my place behind you on this... Survive and prevail, right? There is no... Rises taller than the highest tree. These cards are in their frilled armor, look like Turk. War Chief Sona. War Chief, you, you seem uncomfortable. The Nora do not belong here. I, I will fight the metal devil that threatens us all. But my place is in the sacred land. The wrongness here jags at me like an arrowhead. I'm sorry to put you through. Do not be sorry. This will be ended. My spear, my word. Greetings, Aloy. Don't. You don't need to bow. The anointed doesn't like it. She doesn't much like being called anointed, either. It means a lot to have you. I gave my word. So, Meridian... I've seen... many new things since I first met you. For all what's wrong. You really want to know? All right. I'm in a foreign land, a tainted land, defending a faithless city that looks like nothing I've seen. And you, after all that's happened, oh, I feel like I should drop to my knees and worship you, but I know you don't want that. Boy, things are pretty tough for you. Thanks for telling the other Nora not to bow. It... <laughs> Is that why you came? No. I would have come just to see you one more time. And we must fight a metal devil, because the goddess says, or because you say. I think the goddess and I are in agreement. We're both glad you- So am I. So who are these guys? They call themselves the Eclipse. Aloy. 
So here we are again, gearing up for a fight. Only this time it sounds like the bad guys have a lot... What are we up against, really? I'm not sure. And if they get past us, it's not just Meridian that will fall. The rest of the world will go with it. Well, that's... big. It sounds like our kind of fight. Right, guys? Where do they put the vanguard? At, At the, the front, front of the line! line! And why? Steel before iron! And what are we gonna do? Hit him like a hammer till he can't hit back. back! Damn right! You hear that? Nobody's getting past the vanguard. We're here for Meridian. And we're here for you. Thank you, Erend. Well, only if we win. and Shadow have machines with them. Roland's apartment feels empty. Should I sleep? Did I leave anything unfinished? Elizabeth, with a weight like this pressing on you. How did you rust after you lost your family? Silence? Are you there? I guess I shouldn't ask ghosts for advice. 